Hello, cousins. Welcome back to the channel, Ali. Seven four twenty three nine twenty four a.m. Let's see what's going on. I'm trying to drown out all my background noise. Then again, I could have just put the screen on here. I don't feel like going to go get it, though. You're walking away from something. No fucks given. You don't care. It just is what it is. Fuck it. Yeah. Ten of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. It really is just is what the fuck it is. Like, fuck it. You fed the fuck up with something. Person, place, or thing. You just fed the fuck up. Just all in all. Like, bitch, get the fuck out of my face. The moon. You learn a lot when you're silent. Like, when you just really take a second. You really just take a second to listen. I'm talking fully listening. Like your listening ears fully on, mouth closed. You just listen. And the moon, six of cups. You start to get a grip on what feels to be more reality like. Because something is not the fuck it. Like you wasting your time, your effort, your money, your attention love whatever the fuck you wasting you just wasting that shit on somebody that don't give a fuck or something that doesn't give a fuck you're freely giving thinking that something is um it's supposed to be free flowing like i give to you you give to me you give to me i give to you that's not how this is working though it's very one fucking sided if you listen to something it's almost like whoever you're dealing with if you listen whoever this pertains to if you listen to the shit that they say you'll realize that they're just not there for you the way you are for them. Like, they're just not. Ten of Swords, it's almost like you show up at a time where everything is fucked up, this person down and out, or a situation is fucked up, people are down and out, however it goes, it seems like you're the one that show up as a support system but this ten of swords you by yourself something is actually becoming a burden to you yeah seven of swords in the fucking moon if you actually take the time to listen to whatever listen legit pay attention you'll see what the fuck's really going on somebody does not fuck with you for real like it's a harsh truth but it is true this person does not fuck with you or these people don't fuck with you. But this looks like somebody specific that just, they, they're a taker. And you're a giver. And they play off that. Somebody's very fucking manipulative. Like extremely. An extreme narcissist. Three of Cups. You need to you need to stop fucking with this. Yeah, the Ten of Cups and the fucking and the Ace of Swords, the Hangman. You're gonna see this for what it is. Nine of Cups. You don't need to be a part of this Three of Cups with this person. Not to say you don't need to be a part of a Three of Cups. You just don't need to be a part of Three of Cups with this motherfucking person, or with these other two people. However, this go, but this looks like it could be one other person. It could definitely be two other people, but at least one other person. You don't need to be fucking with that. Because I'm telling you, you will show up, Ten of Swords, you will show up and they fucking, whether it's down bad or just bad real quick, you showing up. They won't do the same for you. Let's say you will show up and if this person is fucked up, you will show up, you will wait for hours to make sure they cool. They wouldn't do the same for you. They show up, wait about five, ten minutes, shit not looking like it's moving, they leaving. Like, it's shit like that. This person does not fuck with you, man at all if you listen to them they will they're literally telling you this right to your face they don't give a fuck about you 
they care about you enough to not see something bad happen to you but other than that they don't care they they couldn't care less that's that's a real harsh and honest truth that they will not fucking tell you they don't care the strength yeah this person's ignorant as fuck i i, I just this person ignorant as fuck ignorant as fuck man I don't know who you're dealing with, but this person is blatantly telling you that they do not care. Blatantly do not give a fuck. Blatantly don't give a fuck, bro. This person's narcissistic. They just foul. This is a foul-ass person. They will never change. You want to know why... Okay, I'm going to put it to you like this. You want to know why... Nobody else, if this person gets fucked up, you want to know why nobody else is showing up? It's because everybody else learned a lesson about this person already. You just the new one trying to come in, trying to trying to be a support system. You can't be a support system for this person. You're going to figure that out. They don't give a fuck about nobody but themselves. That's just the truth. They don't care. No amount of love, attention, effort, nothing is going to get this person to give a fuck. Like, they just won't. They're going to catch this when it's too late, though. By the time they realize you dope as fuck, it's going to be too late. Because it's already too late. They ain't realizing it yet, though. So it's already too late. It's already past that fucking point. But you don't need to be a part of this shit. This, this shit got you fed the fuck up. Ten of Swords, first card out, it got you fed up. And this shit is like, as soon as you ready to walk out the door, here come this person again. Ace of fucking wise. Or as soon as you like completely shut down, like you done completely, here comes this person one way or another. When your energy's closed off to this shit, here they come. They can feel that disconnect. They can feel that detachment. They can feel this disconnect, man. Straight up. And they need to. Because you don't need to fuck with this. Five or yeah, Ten of Pentacles and the King of Cups, and then I see the Empress back here with the uh with the hermit. Thing is, this person is literally fucking playing the fuck out of stupid, dumb, and crazy, bro. Stop fucking with this person. They're they're legit manipulating you. They know exactly what the fuck they're doing. Like this person is legit manipulating you. It's not even a fucking joke. Like this shit is real as fuck. As long as you feed into it, they're going to keep doing this. This person is exposed, bro. They're, they're fucking exposed. They act like they don't know what they're doing. They act like they don't know what's going on. This person acts stupid as fuck. They're not dumb. They're not dumb. This is a fucking, this is a wolf in sheep's clothing, bro. But they got telltales that they, that they're, they have telltales that they're fucked up. Three of swords. You got to let this go. This shit got the potential to get real bad in the long run if you don't cut it off now. Because this person does not care about you. Some of y'all about to be dumb enough to try for a baby with this. A baby ain't going to fix this. Especially if the motherfucker already has a child or has kids. That that situation prior to will let you know that they... This, this particular person does not care about shit. Four swords and the eight of swords. You won't be by your motherfucking self. You decide to keep fucking with this person and end up creating a kid with this person. You won't be mad as fuck. Because you won't be by yourself. You're going to wish you never did it. You're going to want, you're going to still wish you had your kid. Like, you still going to want your kid, just not by who the fuck you have a kid by. That's what you're going to end up with if you keep fucking with this particular situation because that's, that's exactly how it's going to end. You're not going to marry this person. This is not your soulmate. It's a fucking karmic. And it's a karmic that's pulling the same games that you already seen before. This is not even, they're not even doing anything new. This is like when you fucking make a remake to a song. You just change a little bit of shit real quick. It just sound a little different. But the sample, no, it's still the same. I see, I heard, I seen that sample before. I heard that sample. I already know what that shit hit for. Put it like this. Destiny's Child song, um, Say My Name. 
okay for the older ones we heard that shit back when we was younger that was the original version of that song if i'm not mistaken the one that came out with five oh um Naja and koi that's the that's the remake that's the newer version a lot of motherfuckers don't even know that that's that's the sample ver like that's that's the a version from the original song like mother you seen this before that's that's just the bottom line i don't even know why i'm trailing off you you seen this before this is just the the upgraded kind of like version like this ain't even this this shit still don't hit for nothing you've already dealt with this energy before and quite frankly it could really damn near look exactly like a former situation that you were already in and you trying to push it off like no that's not it when that's exactly what the fuck it is if y'all know shit else you know patterns stop playing yourself like you don't understand patterns because you know them very well ace of wands and the three of swords and here it comes again Some of y'all need to be careful because it's going to be three strikes. This, there, there could, you could fuck around, get rid of this energy for the second time in your life, and it could come back around a third. Whole another person, same shit though. You know patterns. Don't play yourself like you don't. You not stupid, they are. The fucking sun and it's exposed, like I said. You ain't fucking dumb. Stop letting motherfuckers play you like you dumb. You ain't stupid. This situation that you're a part of right now, that shit dead. It's big dead. It's done and over. Okay? The star of the five of pentacles and the fucking four of wands is nothing there. You literally are trying to repeat a cycle that you've already done in the past. I just told you this. Six of cups, this shit is not nothing new. It ain't nothing new. Think about it. The tactics that motherfuckers is pulling ain't even the same. I mean, they not even different. They the same. You've seen this before. <coughs> You've literally seen this before. <coughs> mm. Lord. Like, again, you ain't dumb. They are. justice <clears throat> three of swords the sun and justice you you this ain't it and you know it ain't it you just playing with it you just don't feel like this just like when you keep when you keep doing whatever the fuck because you don't feel like nigga i don't even know how to explain this this is like you keep trying to charge your fucking your phone off off the computer instead of just plugging it directly into the outlet didn't i get this example before it's like you're trying to plug you're trying to charge the shit off the computer a less powerful source than just plugging it directly into the fucking grounded outlet where it's literally gonna charge at the rate that's supposed to not a slow rate so now you ain't gotta keep taking your phone off every two seconds trying to trying to answer then the phone dying again no just just hook it up to where it's supposed to be stop fucking with this extra shit this is extra shit right here Wh whoever whatever is extra shit it's extra 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 and i'm reading all about it like point blank not a fucking cook in the fucking fool actually what you really want whatever it is is on the other side of this shit you gotta you gotta get rid of this you can't get to that because you still focus on this shit you so busy being fed up and then fucked up energy dealing with fucked up people let it go the page of fucking swords six of wands nine of swords the queen of cups the moon man nigga if you don't delete that motherfucking number text there ain't going on about your fucking business stop answering your fucking phone for people you don't want to answer from especially this shit here you stop fucking with this you don't want to fuck with it don't fuck with it you are not obligated to do shit that you don't want to do point blank who gonna give you a whooping you don't answer your phone they gonna whoop you 
If that's the case, let me know. We, we'll take care of that. Like, what the fuck is you talking about? Like, stop, stop, stop doing this shit. Just stop doing this right here. Because this ain't even it. You letting somebody play your ass like a whole ass sucker right now, bro. You letting a whole ass, a whole ass bum <clears throat> play you like a sucker right now. And that's on the niggas. I ain't even playing. You you letting somebody play your ass like a sucker. And the whole thing about it is, this ain't even no original energy, bitch. Somebody already did this before. Like, five a fucking wine. Somebody already did this before. This, you, you letting somebody play your ass like a sucker, you done already beat this level? Come on, bro. Stop playing. You got some new shit trying to fuck with you, and you busy focus on this fuck shit over here. This shit eating your energy up. I'm talking like a fucking parasite. It's eating your energy up. Like a fucking tapeworm. This shit's fucking you up, bro. You you literally dealing with a fucking parasite. You're dealing with, like, somebody who's leeching on your energy. Now, they may not be giving you something. They may be. But this person is fucking literally leeching off your energy. That's why you in this ten of swords. You feel alone because you are alone. You're not really fucking with this person. You think the niggas you with is with you? You said hell yeah, but the answer is fuck no. Like the fuck is you talking about? You think the niggas you with is with you? You said hell yeah. Nah, it's hell no. No, they're no, you're not with them, and they ain't with you either. The fuck is you talking about? That's my boyfriend. No, that's your friend. That's my boy. That's your friend. That's my. That is your friend. <clears throat> fuck is you talking about? That's my girlfriend. That's your friend. That's my girlfriend. That's your friend. Okay? Do you understand me? You don't have a girlfriend. You have a friend. And motherfucker, you really ain't even got that. Motherfucker playing with you like this, you really don't even have that. You don't even have a friend. This is not your friend. It's not your boyfriend, not your girlfriend, not your friend, not your husband, not your wife, not your coulda, woulda, shoulda. There ain't none of that shit. You, they back in the queue. We we gave them back to the queue. That that's not no. You know how when your child is like, I got a boyfriend. No, you don't. Your child is like, I got a girlfriend. No, you don't. Fuck is you talking about? You got a friend. You got a friend, and motherfucker, you really don't have that. Let's be clear about something. I don't know what you think you finna do, but you ain't doing that. No, nah, you ain't got no. You got a friend. You got to, and you ain't even got that. The next person trying to come up on you is trying to be a friend and a little bit more than that real fast. And you can't even get to that because you focus on some shit you done already dealt with. Come on now, child. Stop playing. Either piss or get off the pot, bro. Straight up. Like you sitting here chilling for nothing. You sitting here chilling for nothing with some fuck shit. Like, what are you doing? Why are you just chilling in the bathroom on the toilet like this? Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? You just sitting here with your fucking tablet. What are you doing? That's what my niece does. Like, she'll go to go pee. She'll set her little potty thing on the toilet. She'll sit there with her tablet and just pee. And then she'll just sit there. Like, she don't even want to get up. And she's two. Like, like that's just her shit. But, you know, whatever. That ain't, that ain't what, that, she's two. You ain't two. Do you understand what I'm saying? This, this is not what you do. Nah. So what I'm saying is move around. Move around. You ain't you ain't in no relationship, nigga. Move around. I I don't, I don't know. I don't know why I gotta come at y'all like this. But <clears throat> coming straight off the hot ass press. You ain't in no relationship. Move around. This person don't give a fuck about you and you know that. Move around. You're not obligated to be like, hey, I think we should break up. Nigga, they put they moving like this. You ain't in no relationship. What are you talking about? It's a difference between trying to make something work, like it's it's still something there to make something work, versus you trying to force something that's just not there. You've done this before in the past too. You've already played this card. You've played this hand. Remember how it turned out? Cause I got plenty of videos that tell you how it turned out. Go watch them, any of them. Pick one, any of them. I tell you how it turned out. But this ain't it. You ain't fucking with this. This out. All the way out. All the way out. 
nine of cups and a fool you crazy as fuck you thought you was in a relationship you're not you're not i ain't even sorry to tell you that but you're not some of y'all like just need it yeah seven of fucking swords you being played behind your fucking back anyway some of y'all acting crazy as fuck some of y'all like you know what i just feel like we're just no motherfucker if you are not a neighbor, you don't feel like you're in a relationship, you ain't in no fucking relationship. Why is you letting somebody else tell you what you is and what you ain't? You letting me tell you right now whether you in a relationship or not. Some of y'all dead ass like, you right. Some of y'all like, nah, I mean, well, I think I shouldn't be able to, like, change your mind on what the fuck going on right now. You should know. You should know. And if you don't know, then I just told you what it is. If you don't know, now you know. I'll be right back, though.